So secretly Apple has updated the new Apple MacBook Air and it's come with a few nice surprises. They've lowered the price and they've increased the performance power. So we did get a unit on hand. So we're going to do a nice quick unboxing for you guys just to show you what it looks like if you're in the market to buy one of these. They are really, really nice laptops. So without further ado, let's begin the unboxing. So taking a look at the MacBook Air's box, it's exactly the same as the previous years. Nothing has changed in terms of design. On the back, we'll see a specs. One of the only things that's changed is the 1.4 gigahertz processor that's inside powering the device. Now I'm going to take off the plastic and the cover to show you the actual MacBook Pro. And it does come in a clear plastic coated all around just to protect it from any contaminants or whatever during shipping. So taking that off, this is the 2014 MacBook Air. Body-wise, it's exactly the same as the previous year. Uh, has the same screen, same keyboard, uh, overall same ports, nothing different on this version uh, other than the internal specs. It does also come with the power brick. This is the same two portion power brick that we get in all the Macs uh, with the MagSafe 2.0 connector and the power brick along with the optional extender. So the other stuff we get is some paper accessories, including the quick start guide, the warranty booklet, and of course included, you do get the two Apple stickers that are unique to all Apple products. Now, if you guys want to see a comparison of the 2013 MacBook Air compared to the 2014 MacBook Air, uh, subscribe to our channel. We will have a video out soon. Also, we're going to be doing a comparison of the Retina Display MacBook Pro versus the MacBook Air in case you guys are deciding on if you should get the Pro or if you should go for the Air. And that's basically it, guys. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.